often in school, we talk about the golden rule. You know the words. Do unto others as you would have them do unto you. You have also heard the golden rule at home, where you may have heard the words from the Bible this way. As ye would that men should do to you, do ye also to them likewise. That calls for thinking. Pretty soon we'll want to see someone is thinking, and this is the way we'll do it. Listen. We'll call this Thoughtland, and here we can see what someone is thinking. Nancy seems to be thinking that Thoughtland is a strange and wonderful place. We'll come back to Thoughtland, but right now... The chimes carry us back again into our real story. That's the way we're going to think together about the golden rule. Sally has a brand new jump rope. But look, here comes Sally's friend, Jane. Now, what should Sally do? Should she hide the rope so Jane won't see it? But no, Sally thinks about the golden rule. Here we are in Thoughtland. Now Sally knows what to do. A jump rope is something you can have fun with all by yourself. What about showing Jane the rope and making her jealous? Do you see how Sally has used the golden rule to decide what she should do? Look, what are Chuck and Sharon doing? Is this a race? Who's going to win? Uh-oh, be careful, Sharon. Sharon, look out. Sharon isn't hurt, but she can't get up. For a moment, Chuck wants to do for Sharon what he would like Sharon to do for him. But then he thinks, let's think with Chuck. If you fell down and had your feet caught so you couldn't get up, what would you like? So what should Chuck do? To laugh at her. Do you see how you can use the golden rule to help you decide what to do? Try it again. Hopscotch is a game these girls enjoy. But look at Jimmy. Is he too little to play with them? But what about the golden rule? Think about it. Is this what Gail should do for Jimmy? Gail seems to think so. She thinks he would just get in the way. Now with Andy. Let's try one more time to think how the golden rule helps us decide what is the right thing to do. Look what's happening. Do you see the puppy? But Andy is thinking of the golden rule. Say it together. Do unto others as you would have them do unto you. Now, Andy has wanted a puppy for some time, and he thinks this one is mighty cute. In fact, he would like to take the puppy home with him. What do you think Andy should do?